What is up everyone? This is Madeline from the Talk with Ma. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make an outro for your YouTube videos on Canva. Canva is a great, great website for making little, like, you know, blog posts, pictures, you know, YouTube channel arts, and everything and anything your mind can think of. I've already made a video um, called How to Create a Channel Art Using Canva. Um, and I show you how to sign up for this website and create the channel art. So if you want to check it out, um, just go click on the annotation to the right. So first, let's just get started to the video. Um, this is just a simple way to do it. I'm sure there are other ways to create an outro. Um, but um, Blender is a good way, but I find Blender to be extremely complicated. I don't know why. But I just use this system that works for me, and I'm, I just want to show you guys. Because if you're starting out just like me, you want to find a simple way on how to do things. So this is just super quick, five minutes, doesn't take, that you don't have to learn anything too complicated. You just have to do it quickly. So, um, so the first dim dimensions that you are going to put in, you first have to go to custom dimensions. And you have to input in 920 by 1080 right here. And it has to be pixels, not inches, not millimeters, not centimeters, just pixels as you can see. So make sure that it's on PX, that means pixel. And you go to design. And then once the page loads up, um, you're going to go to the first thing you have to do is pick a background. Don't go to layouts, that's a totally different thing. Just go to backgrounds and pick your favorite background. The free ones are at the top, uh, and the ones that you have to pay are at the bottom. Let's just, these are cool, simple, free ones. Let's try to do fireworks. Um, let's see. We can, um, I usually, if I don't find anything that I like on the free background, I, I, could, I can go to, um, I can go to uh, Google, find a uh, background that I like, save it to my computer, and then upload it on here. As you can see, the, hmm, there isn't any free ones that are, oh, look, this one, this one's pretty cool, but. I'm not going to use that. I'm just going to go look with the free ones right here. This is a demo purpose, but if you're, when you're doing your own outro, make sure that you take at least a little time, you know, making sure everything looks right because, you know, just spend as much time as you need on it. This is a, you know, quick thing. And you don't have to do it a certain way like I do it. This is just, I'm just showing you how to do it. So you don't have to use the same background as me, the same fonts, the same anything as me. I'm just gonna use. Oh no, that's too weird looking. Uh, you know what? Let's use this peachy color. Okay, let's just use that. And now we're gonna pick a text. Now you can just. I usually. You can pick a font from here that you like, you know. But I'm just gonna use a simple one. I'm just gonna add, say add heading. Uh, drag it up to here. Um, first, let's just change the color of it. Um, I'm going to make it into black because I think with this color, black looks good. And then I'm going to pick um, a font that I like from here. There is a lot of fonts, actually. This is Everything is free, and they have a lot of options. Um, so I'm just going to pick... Uh, this one, I'm sure it's going to be, don't use any fonts that are really hard to read, but since this is a demo purpose, I'm going to use the hard one. <laughs> Thank, thanks for watching. Put like an exclamation point right there. Um, you can jazz it up however you want. Um, but basically, this is just your way of doing everything. You can drag it over a little bit just to make it. You know, a bit bigger. You can flip it around, but why would you flip it around? <laughs> but basically, um, when you're dragging this, you want to see this little c compass right here, and you can drag it up where you want it. Um, that's not a well, whatever. So you want to put it right there, and 
I want to make sure everything is kind of leveled out, but it gets to be a bit weird after a while, so I'm just going to leave it at that. And then I kind of um, try to make this a bit like a 48 would be good. Yeah, 48 is good. And then now I go to subheadings and I make that black as well, but I try to keep the fonts the same for like everything. So I will put last video. This is like a very hard font to read, but I'm going to make it a bit larger, 28, so it's a bit easier to see. Make it out like this, and I think this is a, I think this is cool, but like, just play with it a little bit. Um, I'm just going to make it go right here until I see that line right there. And then I'm going to look for frames. I'm going to look, I'm going to search up frames right here. And I will look, mo like, almost everything is free for frames. Like, you can do this. Um, you can do any of these. You can do, like, the little phone. That's really cute, actually. Um, let's do that for this one, actually. And we're going to drag it right here. Now, this is a bit bigger than I anticipated. Um, we can make it smaller, but I'm going to bring this up a bit and going to drag this. I'm going to make it this a bit smaller and bring it down right here. Uh, let's see. Yes. So, and then now... For the last video, you're gonna upload your own. So basically, it depends on what you did last video. Um, did you do, um, you know, did you do like Agario? You would put a little, like a little picture of Agario. Or if you did a video of yourself, I don't know, doing anything, just take a screenshot of that video. Um, you, you can do that when you're editing the video. Just take one screenshot of it and then put it right here to represent your video so um for this one i'm just gonna go to upload my own i'm just gonna go here um i'm gonna do it for agario right here so just put it in there as you can see with this you have to kind of play with this a little bit for the agario so you want to find a picture that is like first let's make it a bit smaller a guard oh this is harder <laughs> because like hmm let's just get I would usually okay if you're gonna be using the phone this is what I would suggest I would suggest editing the picture to make it the same size as the iPhone but for now, let's just say the video was called a gaw. <laughs> so that will be it. And last video right there. And then I would have a subscribe button right here. As you can see, you can see my um, outro right there. How I create my outro, actually, how my outro looks. Um, basically, this is how it looks once it loads up. <laughs> So this is how it looks. Um, I, I usually have the subscribe button right there. Uh, and then the until next time, goodbye, that's like my phrase. Um, so right here. And then we're going to find another text. Say add heading. Um, let's change the uh, font. Make it 28. You know. And then we're gonna say follow. Follow me if it's just you, but since there's five of us, it'll be us. Um, so follow us, and then and then I'm gonna. Should I change the color? Nah, I shouldn't change the color. I'm just gonna move it over to here. As you can see, I like to make everything level, so I'll make it the same size as that one. Um, I'm gonna bring this down a little bit, actually. 
So it's not competing on that. And then now I'm going to um, look for, so first you have to decide what um, social medias you have. So for us, we have a Facebook. So I'm just going to search that Facebook right here. So they have a bunch of free symbols for Facebook. But I, I usually try to keep the same kind of feel to it. So if I'm going with the star thing, I'm going to do that. If I'm going with this kind of feel, I'm going to do that. So for now, I'm not going to see how big it is, but I can make it smaller right here. But that's not small either. Let's make it pretty small. Actually, and make it on this right here. You can change the color of that blue to be like whatever color you want it to. But it does to match your theme you're going with your outro. So, and then we're going to go for um, Twitter. I'm just going to do two or three of them really quick. See I'm, how I'm matching the theme of that little star. I don't know what you're, they're called. I'm going to call them star though. Um, it's not the same size. Try to do the same size. You can see the number when you're resizing, so make sure they're about the same size. But for now, for just demo purposes, we're just gonna um, just gonna keep it at that. For Tumblr, as you can see, they don't have that thing, but they do have this. So I'm just gonna go with that one. Just gonna go with that one. I'm gonna make it really small. I try to keep this line, the invisible line that's going. When you kind of make it closer, it gets, it shows you what line it is. And what should we do? I'm gonna see if they have Google Plus. No, actually, I'm just gonna leave it at that for now. But since, as you can see, I, I added Pinterest on there as well. But um, Google Plus, if you have Google Plus, or, you know, let's say you have, I don't know if they have a WordPress one, let's see if they do, if you have Word, oh, they do, so, if you have a WordPress website, I'm actually going to add that to our intro, um, to, I mean, outro, not our intro. I'll also do a video on how to do an intro as well. I'm actually recording it right after this, so um, they will be out back to back. Um, so, and then it's really simple. Just This is just, it's a bit tedious, but, um, but once you get used to it and you've done it already, it's super simple. Super simple. And you can change the outro like every once in a while, so. For Facebook, you will just do facebook.com, whatever your link is. Ooh, my phone is ringing. But basically, you just keep on adding a little body text and next to it. And then you just add everything that you want. Um, I, I would add the um, subscribe button as well because that's very important. Just add the subscribe button right there just make sure that you're laying it out like perfectly how you want it and just make sure if you do everything you know how you want it will look good um so like for this subscribe the font i hate this font um it looks really weird but subscribe and then you just add anything you want. Do you want to add, I don't know, hearts? Just find, um, there are free hearts, by the way. <laughs> um, like this one. I'm going to add this one right here. Just add anywhere. However you want it. Just, you can add whatever you want to this. That, that is why I love this website. Because... You can just do anything that your mind can think of. Um, do you want to add dogs? 
Last time I remember I was saying that dogs weren't free, but I found a free dog. I remember doing this um for the um, channel art and I couldn't find a dog that was free. But look, this dog is free. We have found a dog that is free. Oh my gosh. Um, You can do cats. You know, just add anything you want. If you look for it, there will be a free cat. Just keep looking for it, and there is always a free cat. But thanks so much for watching this. Um, I will let you know how to do. Just basically, after you finish this, um, just add. Go to YouTube um audio library. You just you just go over there. Look, look for like a audio that you really like. Go to your like whatever you use to edit your video. Um, add in this picture and then add in the audio below it and that's it that's just how you do a simple little outro so if you enjoyed this video make sure to share it and like also subscribe and let me know what you think of this video in the comments below of course if you have any questions do let me know I will try to answer every question as as quickly as possible so thank you so much for watching until next time goodbye